fabric selection. Do you have questions about fabric selection for theatrical curtains? Between all the curtain types used on a stage, all the different fabrics available, and balancing your client's needs with their budget, choosing the right fabric for a project can seem overwhelming. Some dealers choose the same few fabrics again and again for all jobs simply because those fabrics have worked in the past on some jobs. Don't fall into this habit. Learn about all the fabrics available so that you're choosing the optimal fabric for the job, not just the fabrics you've chosen before. To select optimal fabric for a job, you must learn the characteristics of each fabric. You must also understand how all the fabrics relate both to one another and also to the client's needs. First, let's see how theatrical curtains have evolved over the years. Until about 15 years ago, all theatrical curtains were made of cotton fabric. Then synthetic fabrics came along and the possibilities for theatrical curtains were obvious. Cottons are slightly cheaper, have been used extensively in the past, are not accepted by fire marshals in some areas, must be periodically retreated for flame retardancy, and are marginally more sound absorbent. Synthetic fabrics are much more durable than cotton, permanently flame retardant and never need retreating, more opaque than cotton, available in the same colors as cotton, and are a much better value for the cost. What exactly does flame retardant mean? Also can be called fire retardant or fire resistant. Flame retardant, or FR, means the fabric passes the applicable tests to inhibit flame propagation, most commonly the NFPA 701 test. We often use the term FR to mean combustible natural fiber fabrics that have been chemically treated. However, FR really includes any fabric which meets the applicable standards. Inherently flame retardant, or IFR, is a specific subset of FR. IFR means the FR properties are inherent to the yarn rather than being contained in a topical treatment which can break down or be removed. No curtain is fireproof. Any fabric will burn given enough heat. Now let's take a look at different categories of fabrics and see how they fit together. This chart will help you understand the different categories of fabrics. Let's go through it one category at a time. All fabrics can be divided into two main categories, cotton or synthetic. We've already looked at some basic differences between them, but let's go into a little more detail starting with FR cotton. Flame resistant cotton is available in a wide range of colors and has been chemically treated with fire retardant. If it gets wet, it must be dry cleaned and then retreated for fire retardancy. FR cotton, while widely used years ago, is seldom used today. As a dealer, it is important to learn about cotton fabrics because many theaters still have cotton curtains in place. Many customers still ask for cotton fabrics because that is all they know. It is your job to educate your customers on the best fabric choices for their needs. Occasionally, you will hear someone expressing preference for FR cotton because of better sound absorbency. While technically cotton is slightly more sound absorbent than synthetic, the difference is so minimal that it does not make a perceptible difference in outcome. This argument alone is not a reason to choose cotton over synthetic. Looking at the IFR, inherently flame resistant synthetic category, we remember that IFR synthetic is more durable than cotton and never needs retreating for flame retardancy. IFR synthetic is more opaque than cotton and stains can be cleaned with a damp cloth. Now, filling in our chart from top to bottom, we see that FR cottons and IFR synthetics can be further divided into categories. Let's look first at the woven velours which have a deep plush pile. Woven velour is usually used for front setting curtains, main drape and valance, and sometimes for rear setting curtains as well. Woven velour is sometimes referred to as theatrical velour or theatrical velvet. Velours are traditionally a picked fabric. The face side has hundreds of tiny tufts or piles per square inch. Velour is a napped or cut pile woven fabric. Woven velour is made by pile weaving yarns together. The nap of the fabric is achieved by cutting the looped ends of the pile, creating a cut pile. Imagine the looped pile of a Berber carpet, and then the cut pile of a regular plush carpet. Woven velour has a cut pile. Let's focus for a moment on the FR Cotton Woven Velour fabrics. These are the FR Cotton Woven Velour fabric names along with their weights. One way to remember the cotton fabric names is that they all start with the letter M, except for Princess, which is a rarely used fabric. 
Memorable was historically the most utilized fabric for stage curtains, but we seldom use it now. The heavier the weight, the nicer and more luxurious the fabric will be. In addition, the higher the number, the more expensive the fabric will be. Fabric weight is important when considering the end usage of the fabric. Choosing a stage curtain fabric can be subjective. Although synthetic fabrics offer a great many benefits, some people simply like cotton better. Be careful not to choose cotton fabric simply because that is what you have used in the past. Educate yourself on the benefits of synthetic versus cotton before you choose a fabric for a job. Now let's look at the IFR Synthetic Woven Velour Fabrics. These are the woven IFR synthetic fabric names along with their weights. These fabrics have been woven and dyed to be equivalents to the cotton fabrics. Most synthetics will cost a little more than an identical cotton version, but since synthetics tend to be more opaque, a lighter weight fabric can often be used. Typically, this entirely offsets the cost difference and has the added benefit of reducing curtain weight, making the curtains easier to handle and causing less wear on tracks and rigging. Remember, the heavier the weight, the more expensive the fabric will be. Imperial and Royale are considered top-of-the-line fabrics, while Plateau is often used in smaller spaces as a fabric choice in rear setting curtains. How do the woven velours correspond with each other? Here we see the cotton velours on the left and the corresponding synthetic velours on the right. When helping your customers decide whether cotton or synthetic fabric will be best for their stage curtain needs, be sure to consider cost, weight, opacity, and durability for each fabric choice to help them make an informed decision. Now that we understand how the woven velours correlate, let's move on to knitted velours. Knitted velours usually have a brushed appearance. There are no cotton knitted velours. Synthetic knitted velours are useful for many different scenarios from front setting curtains to rear setting curtains. While not a traditional velour, these plush sanded fabrics are used in place of and thus referred to as velour. They are very opaque, high quality fabrics which provide excellent value for most scenarios. Let's learn more about the IFR synthetic knitted velour fabrics. A popular choice in knitted velours is Encore, available in two weights and 12 colors. It is an excellent, all purpose, highly opaque stage fabric. Encore has a fuzzy, felt like finish. Remember, the heavier the weight, the more expensive the fabric will be. Encore 22, though less expensive than a woven synthetic of the same weight, costs more than the lighter weight Encore 15. The other two fabrics in the knitted velours category are the very popular Prospect and Prism. These are exceptional, very soft, highly opaque fabrics available in deep black, dark blue, or provincial, and dark red, or cabernet. Prospect and Prism are superior to Encore in quality and cost less, providing an excellent value for all kinds of venues. Unlike Encore, Prospect and Prism are specifically milled for use as stage curtains. Remember, the heavier the weight, the more expensive the fabric will be. Prospect, though less expensive than Encore, costs more than the lighter weight Prism. How do the knitted velours correspond with each other? Prospect is equivalent in weight to Encore 22 and Prism to Encore 15. Prospect and Prism are superior to Encore in quality but cost less. The advantage of Encore is that it is available in more colors than Prospect and Prism. Now we'll examine the last category, Reps and Other. Reps and other fabrics have been around for a long time, but are not ideal unless budget is very limited. They are not napped, but may have a brushed, modeled, or patterned appearance. They are useful for temporary curtains or other limited applications. Rep fabrics are less expensive than velours and have a woven herringbone pattern to them. They provide modest light blocking and sound dampening. Let's take a look at the FR Cotton Rep fabrics. Cotton Rep fabrics include Atlas Oxford and Nassau Chevron, which are sometimes useful in small theaters with very limited budgets. However, for rear setting curtains, typically black, knitted velour such as Prism offer a far superior choice at roughly the same cost. Although duvetine is not a rep fabric, we have included it here because it is also a low budget cotton fabric choice. Duvetine has a felt like feel and is only useful as a temporary masking fabric. Finally, we'll examine the IFR synthetic rep fabrics. 
Synthetic rep fabrics include Dural and IFR Chevron. Dural is a vinyl-backed IFR rep fabric best suited for use on small stages, particularly in schools with young children. The vinyl is durable and easy to wipe clean with a damp sponge and mild soap. It comes in 16 colors with either a black or beige backing. IFR Chevron is suitable for low-budget rear-setting curtains on small stages and in schools. It comes in 15 colors and has a slight sheen and a herringbone rep pattern. Again, Prism is a far better choice for black rear-setting curtains. While the fabrics in the rep category do not generally correspond with each other in the same way as the velours, IFR Chevron is the synthetic equivalent to Nassau Chevron. When considering fabrics where budget is a concern, remember that fabric cost increases as you move from bottom to top on the chart. The most expensive and luxurious fabrics are at the top, the economy fabrics are at the bottom, and the all-purpose fabrics with the best value are in the middle. What about seamless goods? Muslin, for drops, painted drops, and sykes, is available in natural, white, and other colors in varying widths depending on the color. NFR muslin is available for painted drops only. FR scrim, or shark's tooth, is available in black, white, blue, gray, and natural in varying widths. FR leno is available in white and gray. Not every color or FR IFR or NFR combination is available in every fabric or width. For detailed information about seamless goods, contact us. There are many possible combinations of fabrics from which to choose, depending on the customer's needs and the type of venue in which the fabric will be housed. Let's take a look at a few common customer scenarios and fabric combinations. Study the following slides to learn about how fabrics can be utilized for different spaces. If you have questions about fabric selection for stage curtains, give us a call at 1-800-372-3373. Thanks for watching.